Hello everyone, welcome back to the new episode of my tutorial series on software development. In the previous episode, we have successfully added the functionality to add new dealer or customer and update and delete existing dealer or customer in our billing and inventory management system. In this episode, we will add search functionality or search feature in our dealer or customer module. So without further delay, let's move to our tutorial series. <laughs> So first of all we need to open our project so go to the project folder and open the solution file and the project will open on our Microsoft Visual Studio IDE go to the form this is our form for our dealer and customer uh, in order to add search functionality first of all we'll need to create a method in our dealer or customer data access layer so go to the solution explorer and go to the dal and open dcost dal so this is it guys now we need to create a method for search functionality so i'll create a region has region search method for dealer and customer module and has in region between these we will create a data table type data type method so public data table csrs and we will pass a string variable so a string keyword and curly braces so there's error but don't worry about the error uh, it uh, this method requires a, a data table to be returned so first step is to create a SQL connection so connection so SQL connection con is equals to new SQL connection using my connection string then we will create a data table and return its value so data Uh, data table and returning its value so data table dt equals new data table and we will return dt so this fixed the error but uh, between these uh, two line of code we need to add actual code to search uh, dealer or customer based on id type and name so let's start with try block try and then catch here we will write e exception ex and then we will display a message if there are any exceptional errors so message box dot so ex dot message and finally we will close the database connection so connection dot close this will close the database connection and between in try block we will write the code to search the dealer or customer based on id type and name so write the query to search dealer or customer based on id type and name so string sql equals select a string from tbl underscore d underscore cost where id like percentage percentage and plus plus keyword and another condition or type like percentage percentage and plus plus keyword or name like percentage percentage keyword so that's it this is the query uh, to display all the dealer or customer uh, based on keyword typed on the source box which will source based on id 
type or name so this is it guys uh, now we need to create a sql command to execute the query so sql command cmd equals new sql command using sql and connection so that's it and then we need to create a sql data adapter to hold the data for temporarily so to hold the data from database temporarily so sql data adapter adapter equals new sql data adapter using cmd so that's it now we need to open the database connection connection so connection dot open and uh, pass the value from adapter to data table so value from adapter to data table so adapter dot fill dt so this will pass the value from adapter to data table so this is it guys uh, we have successfully created a method to search dealer or customer uh, from database let's say bit control and s and minimize it now we need to use this method uh, in our form so let's select the dealer and customer text box text box source text box this is our source text box and go to properties and click on this thunder icon and search for text change event here it is so double click on it to create an event so this is it first step is to uh, get the keyword typed on uh, this text box so get the keyword from text box text box so a string keyword equals txt search the text so that's it now we need to uh, check uh, whether the uh, user has typed any keyword on text box or not if the text box has any data then uh, this will uh, filter the data using the search method uh, but if uh, the text box do not have any value then the data will be shown using the select method which will show all the uh, dealer and customer so let's check if keyword is not null null then search the data dealer or customer else so all the dealer or customer for that we'll be using search for search we'll be using uh, search method so data table dt equals dc dal dot yes search and we'll pass keyword here and dgv dot data source data source is equals to dt and for showing all the dealer customer data table dt equals dc dal dot select so that's it we do not need to pass any value here so not search select that's it now dgv dot data source is equals to dt so that's it we have successfully created an event uh, to search the dealer customer in our dealer customer module so let's check it out if it works or not start our application and log in admin admin and user type is admin and login login successful dealer or customer and let's add uh, another user to so dealer it will be gg hadid 
and gg at hotit.com and then contact is don't know you unite ed just a t e s of america and add so we have two uh, users one is customer another one is dealer and tom hanks and gg hadit so we are searching based on id type and name so i'll type id so one it shows the one based on id and two there are no users uh, with two id so three there is one okay then dealer is one and customer so customer is one so passed then tom hanks is one and gg is one so we have successfully added a functionality to uh, source dealer or customer based on keywords uh, so which will look after id type and name and display the results so this is it guys thank you so much for watching if you like this video then don't forget to like share and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and get notified when i upload new videos uh, in the next video we will be uh, starting new uh, module which is the most important module for our billing and inventory management system uh, it is a purchase and sales form and it will be able to record all the transactions uh, including purchase and sales from customer and supplier so don't miss out so till then see you soon bye bye